What's up, y'all? This Trill 3L's Trillion Dollar Man. Real quick, I want to do a review on um, a Loaded Lux song, Fate, that he just released a few um, days ago. Now, first I'm going to say, dope-ass song, dope-ass video. Like, Loaded Lux has, has dope music. He's one of the few battle rappers in the game that can actually make good music. Now... The only thing I don't like about it is, because you know I got to stay what I don't like about it. Um, I feel like the image is the only problem for him. Now, what I mean by that is all of his fans that he has, or majority of his fans that he has, are from Battle Rap. Um, they, are, they were already fans of him. They're already fans of Battle Rap, so naturally they're going to support his music now not his not the rest of the songs but with this song it sounds like he was able to integrate the new wave like the the new generation's sound and style into this song and he did it actually pretty well i've heard on songs before where he did done it before but so with that being said with this song i feel like obviously or if you're not um, marketing it to like the, the this new generation, that's not your demographic. That's where that song should. That's where that song should be marketed to. Now, that being said, also when it comes to the image, when they're looking at this, because a, a lot of um, a lot of people they look at image as well, not just the music. So it's gonna look like a 30 year old plus. Dude dying in front of his hair, dancing like the new cats, and is is really not gonna is really not gonna work well in generating new fans, um, outside of battle rap. Now and again, like I said, it's a dope song, so I'm not taking nothing from the song, because if like people are listening to the song, not looking at the video, and they don't know who who it is, they just listening to the song, they heard it somewhere. I will actually go check out more of his music and try to find out who it is. But if somebody's watching the video, I don't see like I don't see the young um the younger generation is like, oh, I gotta look at more of his videos or check out more of his music just because the image doesn't match the song. Like it doesn't sound like I mean it doesn't look like he should be saying whatever he's saying or in the way that he's saying it in that video. But um again though video he had Joey Badass in the video, Rode Me or Riding Me, whatever his name is, the um the dude from Power, he was in it and T Pain was in it. They actually should have been on the song. And again, also, if he would have like gave that song to like a one of the younger dudes, the song would be like even doper. Like picture Joey Badass spitting that song, like the chorus or something. Like that song would be even that much doper. Um. It actually is reminiscent of like Kevin Gates style, like not like one of the songs that you hear on the radio, but like one of his like older mixtapes, um, like the first Luca Brasi mixtape. Um, it reminds me of kind of like old Hold Your Head from that mixtape. But yeah, like it just has it just has that certain sound that somebody younger should be spitting. But anyway, it was like I said again, dope song. Not taking anything away from him. This is just my thoughts on it and my opinion on it um i'm gonna be doing more reviews on different battle rappers that is putting out music because like i said it's a lot of dope mcs out there in battle rap that can make good music but they don't get any attention so i'm gonna just make note of that um again i'm gonna still do my recaps my battle rap recaps um so check out those and remember to like comment and subscribe True 3L is tree and dollar man. Peace.